So part of our digital preparedness plan is to develop a mobile app, which will enable customers to be able to make orders directly um, on the app once they download it. And from there, we'll be able to um, you know, deliver it for them. What's unique about this is they'll be able to see their um, product that they've ordered coming from right from Tiavanga to their doorstep or whichever delivery point that they want to have. This ena will enable us to have traceability, which is especially important for a lot of consumers, um, both international and local as well. Um, it will also help us with our data management um, to be able to collect data on um, customer preferences, the types of products that they like to order, um, and help us to plan in terms of inventory. On your risks, I see you've put competition as a risk, and I've also seen reluctance by customers to buy crayfish as a risk. Those two are not risks. Okay? They make up your business case. That's why you went into that business. So if you think that cast local customers will not buy crayfish, don't sell to them. <laughs> it's simple. And if you think competition is a risk, don't go into that business. So they're not risks. Don't so don't think about them as risks, okay? They're, they're part and parcel of every business. You, you have to have competition and you, and you have some customers and some will not be your customers. Um, so far, Coibles, when it comes to uh, digital, currently, nah, not much has been done. We are, we are basically, maybe the use of technology has been maybe the computer use, and other small, small gadgets. But the plan itself for Coebles is that we are planning to, to move the, the, the moving from the keeping of the documents manually to Excel. So that we have, we have planned for it to the level that we are even trained by GIZ. And we have the certificates. We are trained, two members of staff in our company we are trained in Excel. Uh, one of the key risks is governance, and you've touched on it. Um, my advice to you is, I think, try to formalize the business. So if you if you want the children to participate in the business, have formal structures where they have a channel which they can contribute. So if uh, they finish school and they join the business, have defined roles and defined key performance indicators, which they know they'll have to meet. So start working on that so that when they come in the business, there's space for them. All right. And in this case, modern agriculture, we consensusly agreed as a panel of elders that you will leave the competition at this point. Thank you. So congratulations again for making it to the next round. Your next task involves you giving us solutions to an hypothetical situation that will be given to you. As you know, businesses change, environments change, there's disruption at any given time, okay? Anything can happen. So we are going to give you a situation and when you come back, we need you to tell us what solutions or how you would have resolved or handled or managed that particular situation. Okay.